Where we are going, we don't need no friends. Yes, because we have the OI Share app that is taking the photo for us. Okay, let's be honest. There is self timers in every camera. Right? Yeah. But we're not using that today. Nope. We want to amp up the self portrait in some other way. Yeah, there's always a situation where the self timer isn't enough mm -hmm. and where the reach of your arm is too short. So, say you want to take a photo of yourself doing some aerial acrobatics or. When you have to be really precise with the shutter button. Yeah. And take your time with the composition. Yeah, of course there's like, there's all these kind of different launchers and Bluetooth devices, etc. But the Olympus system actually has something built right in called OI Share. Yeah, so this is a free app you can download to your iPhone or Android device and you can see yourself live from, your, from yeah. the app. And not just give me the live view, but actually give me almost full control of the ma major functions, you know, white balance, I ISO, like my, my picture modes if I want to take a high speed, mm, whatever. Yeah. All that, all that basic stuff. Well, I think because of that app, today we should take a self-portrait with this function. Ah, sounds fun. Something that is not achievable with this normal self-timer. Okay. Something where the timing has to be really precise. All right. I call aerial acrobatics. I call whatever comes to my mind, I don't know yet. But anyway, we're gonna head outside and make magic with OI Share. Now what I want to try to do here is to take a photo that usually would be really difficult to do by yourself. So I found this really cool wall uh, next to this art museum in Helsinki. And what I want to make it feel like is that there is this balcony or this hole in the wall somewhere up when it actually is a door on the ground. Now to make this photo actually happen, I've got the camera normally horizontal on the ground and I've got the OISHARE app open with the remote ready to go. So what Olympus Image Share actually is, is an app that allows you to do a few things very well. It First of all, it allows you to import all your photos via Wi-Fi or Bluetooth onto your smartphone, pad, tablet, whatever you have. Mm -hmm. uh, the second thing is that you can geotag, you can actually do some slight edit, edit adjustments. Mm -hmm. And the feature that we'll be exploring today is uh, the camera control. Oh yeah. Come on. So the camera control gives you a live view of what's actually happening. You see everything that's going on and you're able to change settings. And what that opens up is that you can go pretty far away from the camera and get very precise timed images. I think I've got the photo. I think it's gonna be weird and fantastic. Uh, let's go see what Jonas can do. Now my spot for the selfie was actually quite near Janne's place. I saw him doing his crazy stunts. I don't know what he's doing, but I saw this really nice staircase with perfect lighting. I think I want to play with the shadows. For this photo, I had the idea that I want to be levitating on the phone and creating a nice shadow behind me. So I'm using the setting sequence high to take multiple pictures at once. With the first shots, I realized that the exposure was too bright. So it was fairly easy to just adjust the exposure from the phone rather than just walking back to the camera and adjusting it from there and also the focus because I could just point at the screen where I am and the camera picks the focus perfectly. Now my photos are finished. Now let's get back to the studio. Okay, we're back. We're back. I hope you're not as sore from taking the photos as I am. <laughs> and I, I may have sque squeezed myself into places that no man should squeeze himself. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah. And I think I hurt my back doing my stunts, yeah. or stunts, but on this age, walking is a stunt for me. Yep, <laughs> old man should a job. No, <laughs> well, show me your photos. Okay, I'll show you. So what I wanted to do is kind of twist the normal perception of things mm. and create this scene where I look like I'm in a place where you actually have no idea where I could be. So yeah. I'm gonna show that camera first. There we go. Okay, and what do you think? Oh, you flipped it. I did. Because I felt like, you know, with these, with these little, little things, it almost looks like it's a ladder or something yeah. that you can, you know, climb up that. I, I saw you dangling here, but of course I saw it on normal perspective. Yeah. And I was like, yeah, it's a 
funny thing. Yeah. <laughs> but but you flipped it. I did so flip it. It makes it completely different. So if you if you wouldn't have seen me, what would you think of? I would actually think that you are actually on a ledge yeah. somewhere high. Yeah. Good job. Thanks. Okay. You want to see mine? I do. I saw I saw a few glimpses of what you were doing, but I yeah. want to see what the results. The main thing in this photo, I wanted to hide that I'm using the phone as yeah. a remote control. So I was I was snapping away with the <laughs> with the phone. That's a fantastic idea, actually. Yeah. I like that. Here we go. Ah! <laughs> That's actually super cool. Yeah. So I have to be really stiff while mid air. And you get the shutter speed really good. It's like you can't see any motion blur or anything. No. I like that. I like yeah. that. You're like, uh, you know, your business is so hot it makes you fly. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> okay. Or I'm so light pocketed. All the money is flying out of your pockets yes, that is exactly. taking it with you. Okay. <laughs> I like yeah, that. Yeah, I, I was using the high sequence as you was also using, mm, right? I used it on one of the photos, but then I was like, ah, don't need it. Okay. And I just kind of actually snapped it on the other one. Yeah. Yeah. I think in this kind of photo, the timing is so perfect. Yeah. I wouldn't have done it with that. Yeah. selfie timer because the trial and error would it be yeah too much yeah, you probably got this on like the third try or something yeah yeah that was that's was, that was the thing is like it didn't take a long time i think we were no, no. five minutes in and out with both couple, of, couple of jumps and that's it yeah good job all right so using washer uh, it's a super nifty little feature i actually really like that so what did you learn well i learned that if you don't have any friends no problem because the oy share is your friend that's right. It's fairly easy to take selfies with a with a software like this, where you can actually see everything simultaneously. And, it's yeah. so much quicker than having to do it with a timer or whatso. Yeah. You know, mm. I especially like that I can tweak the settings. Exactly. I can I can see the results straight away, and mm. I don't have to run it, like ever run back to the camera. Yeah, but I think this is a pretty pretty nice challenge that everyone should give it a go. Yeah, check out the OI Share, and there's some really great tips and tricks on uh, on the Olympus channels. Mm. for everything that you can do with it. Yeah. All right. Until next time. Bye-bye.